got a whole box of goodies of things that I have been buying, makeup, um, and new things that a couple of them I tried because I was just a little too excited. A lot of them I have not, and today I'm doing my whole face, this face right here with products from the box and seeing what I like and what I don't like. So grab your, I always think it's so funny when people do this, but grab your snacks and your tea and whatever you drink in and let go. Right here. Dangerous territory taking this little cap off. Dangerous territory. Let's see. If I put this on. Oh, yep, that's that's dark. Just gonna kind of darken up the outer edge a little bit of that. Two stairs. And when I do that, I don't think you can tell that it's super shiny, Ooh, but I like it. Hey, hey, I like color. What? Okay, okay. I see you. Whew. Ooh. Look at this. Mm -hmm. I bet you could use this as a highlighter too, and just like this, this would be some serious shit right here. Look at this. Boom. It's just blinding you. That's all there is. It's just blind. 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 Look at this right next to my highlighter. <laughs> this is so nice. Oh my god, I'm putting this on my eye like now. And this is like a super simple eye. That looks so bougie. I'm just gonna put a little bit on my face, like a highlighter. Most people don't want to go crazy with their highlighter, but not me. Not me. I wasn't born. I wasn't born like that. Mm -mm. I was born to be extra AF. I have the Eye Tech Bold Liquid Eyeliner. <laughs> <laughs> One stroke application. Well, but yet it says long lasting. Where? That is bold and felt tip. And, 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 it, and it, looks, <laughs> it looks like this. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. I haven't played with this one. Oh, it's like a big old marker. Uh, hopefully it's not dried out. Hey bro, you dried out? Oh god, no. Apparently it's not. It's not, so... Yeah, let's go. I also got this baby in here. The... My Mark Jacobs find from... I didn't use this baby, but uh, this looks like my, my, my dating wheelhouse right here. Oh god, it's so cute. Oh my god. Oh, I love everything Mark Jacobs. Mark Jacobs can do no wrong with my eyes. But, I'm just gonna line waterline with the uh what is this called the black highliner tweezers and curl my eyelashes and try not to curl my lids that, that's, that's the key there now more looking got things stuck in my head ow don't do your lids woman just curl your eyelashes. We don't have to be that extra AF. I feel like I got arthritis just from doing that. Yes. 
Velvet Noir Major Volume. Yeah. Yeah. This is the good stuff, right? Oh. Yeah. I'm trying to decide if... Because I just started wearing false eyelashes. I wore false eyelashes the other day. Actually, with this outfit. Um, and, oh my god. I fell in love. I fell in love. And I'm... I'll probably attach the little video I did to the end of this video, but yeah. Oh, I fell in love. Now I know why like lash studios are a big thing now. I'm seeing them everywhere. Oh my god. Cause like these look quite that's just one coat. Like what if we kept going? Look how how big can we build this, Mark? Mark, Mark, what are you doing to me? Okay, so the late makeup, the make mascara makeup hack is that you let this baby dry, this little, well, that's a big mistake. Let it dry instead of wiping it off right now, and then it should flake off. But that doesn't work with every formula of mascara. Like, for example, I know for a fact, I'm looking at the um, Too Faced Better Than Sex, not the waterproof one, the regular one. I haven't tried the waterproof one. Um, the Too Faced Better Than Sex one will not flake off. You'll just have to wipe it, so you're better off wiping it while it's wet. So you just gotta know going in which mascara formulas will do that and which won't. So we'll find out if this one does it. So yeah, I did it on purpose. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. Yeah. This is my favorite little cheapy elf brow pencil. And this is what, the one in black? And deep brown, yeah, oh, I don't like the one in black. Black one's too too much, but the, the deep brown works. I don't know why they even make brow products that are are black. Because um, I have black hair, and I don't know who the hell uses that. Like, I walk into the brow bar at Ulta, and they're like, no, get the four. I'm like, well, who gets the six? And who gets the five? Because my hair is pretty black. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Who are you making that for? Raccoons? I'm not sure. I'm going to take Milani's Easy Brow Tinted Fiber Gel in Dark Brown. Don't look like it's going to match. Filling in these uh, sparse areas, especially the front here. Should just call makeup deception. Because that's really all it is. Deceiving people about how beautiful we naturally are. It gave me hairs, but it didn't give me definition. I keep trying. You keep Uh-oh, this was not completely dry. Because that could have been awkward. Okay. Still need a little bit of definitions. Let's see. Go here, yep. Mm -hmm. Just work on this outline a little bit. All right, so got somewhat semblance of an eyebrow, which is really hard for me because the tails of my eyebrows like don't exist anymore. Because when I went to get my eyebrows waxed they ripped my skin off so yeah nothing is gonna ever grow back there whatever but I'm gonna wear my signature because I wear it all the time super stay Maybelline matte ink in number 80 Rula Rula it's basically like a pinky red and ooh. I just took a DNA test, turns out. 
I'm 100%. I'm just kidding. I can pull my hair down. I love these earrings. They match this dress so well. I can see rings in my circle of vision. And your YouTuber, I see, is the diva life. The diva life. The circle ring. Your vision all the time. Look. Jesus. Nope, it's not Jesus coming. It's just my diva light left in my vision. <laughs>